Welcome to the AIHCE Virtual Expo. My name is Tom Garms, and I'm the Midwest Regional Sales Manager for Gas Glove Technologies. I live approximately 35 miles northwest of the city of Chicago, and I cover 10 states for Gas Glove Technologies. But let's not be mistaken here. I am a huge Cubs fan. Gas Club Technologies was founded on returning safety, simplicity, and reliability and customer satisfaction to the gas detection business. But let's not ask me, let's ask Google about a question about gas detectors. Hey, Google, tell us about gas detectors. According to Wikipedia, a gas detector is a device that detects the presence of gases in an area, often as part of a safety system. A gas detector can sound an alarm to operators in the area where the leak is occurring, giving them the opportunity to leave. Well, thank you, Google. I'm gonna spend a few minutes talking to you today about our single gas clip detector. This one has the yellow color casing. It has a two year runtime and is designed to be a disposable model so that once it's been activated, the runtime starts and cannot be deactivated. To activate the detector, you simply press and hold the push button for five seconds. This will start and run through a self check. The single gas clip detector is a reliable, disposable, and portable single gas detector, which ensures constant protection against toxic gas in the harshest of working conditions. It has an unmatched sensor reliability for hydrogen, sulfide, carbon monoxide, and oxygen, and adjustable alarm set points and real-time gas reading capabilities. All very important. As well as a simple to use one button operation, the two-way IR for event downloads, bump test, detector configuration, and firmware updates. It has programmable six-digit detection identification. The single gas clip is a lightweight yet durable and clamps on tight with alligator clips. Some of the markets that it's used in are refineries, steel plants, coal plants, food processing plants, fire departments, road construction, bridge construction, and anywhere where it can find safe safety is important. Single gas clip products, as well as our other products, are available through our distribution network. Gas clips technology stocks and manufactures all of our products in Cedar Hills, Texas, a suburb of Dallas. And we carry a large inventory to cover all our end users and distributors worldwide. Please check out Gas Clip Technologies at www.gasclip.tech.com for updated brochures, some training videos, and anything else you may need. I'd like to thank you for your time and your commitment to safety. Hi, my name is Sean Clements from Gas Clip Technologies. I'm the Mid-Atlantic Regional Territory Sales Manager. My territory consists of the state of New York, New Jersey, Pennsylvania, Ohio, West Virginia, Virginia, Maryland, Delaware, and the District of Columbia. Gas Clip Technologies is a manufacturer of portable gas detection equipment based just outside of Dallas, Texas. We at Gas Clip have decided to focus on the four primary gases uh, encountered in industry every day. Oxygen, O2, carbon monoxide, CO, hydrogen sulfide, H2S, and combustible gases represented by the LEL icon. While we at Gas Clip are most primarily noted for the introduction of IR sensor technology in the detection of combustible gases, we do have a great deal of experience and knowledge when it comes to the toxic gases. We do that via two different platforms at this time. Uh, the multi-gas platform, which are the MGC, uh, the Simple, and the Simple Plus. And we also do it via single gas platforms the SGC and the SGC Plus. I'm going to talk for a minute about the SGC Plus today. The SGC Plus is most easily identifiable by its bright orange color. You'll note the, the single button operation and the crystal clear display. Uh, the monitor is a two-year monitor, but it has a functional three-year life span on it, meaning you can take the monitor once it's activated, run it for a month, six months, a year, and then you can shut it down for up to one year cumulatively or in one shot and turn it back on and still have that unit working 
So you get two years runtime out of a monitor, even if it takes three years to get that two year runtime. Very big in the contractor market as they go through shutdowns and turnarounds. You bring a lot of labor force in at one time you can use them. You don't have that many on the next job rather than wasting those, uh, those resources and lettering them, let them spend out in a drawer. You can shut them down and still use them next time. Um, the, the units and uh, the STC plus comes in hydrogen sulfide and CO. They never need calibrated. We do recommend that you bump test prior to each day's use. Uh, the ways to do that are manually or the preferred and easiest way is with the bump test station. You can put it in single button operation. It'll do your calibrations, your bump test, and most importantly, record all your data for your record keeping in there, which is a really important part of this uh, transaction. Other than that, you have the 95 dB alarm, vibra alert with a flashing light. Uh, there's a lot of software that comes with the unit that you can see and go through, manipulate the data to identify what you're having in there. If there is something you want to experience um, with the, the software or with the monitor itself, I would suggest you contact myself or one of my counterparts at www.gasclipptech.com or you can always get hold of us at 972-775-7577. Hello, welcome to the GasClip group of products. My name is Darcy Gable. I'm the Western Canada Regional Sales Manager for GasClip Technologies. GasClip Technologies is a manufacturer of safe and reliable gas detection products. Founded in 2009, GasClip Technologies pursues the goal of revolutionizing portable gas detection technology. Whether you work in the oil and gas industry, utilities, wastewater, telecommunications, marine, or any other industry, Gas Clip Technologies gives you reliable and durable portable gas detectors. Today, I would like to talk to you about our Gas Clip MGC, four gas portable gas detection unit, which consists of four sensors, LEL, oxygen, CO, and H2S. The MGC monitor is the industrial leader in battery life. It has a two month continuous runtime without having to recharge the battery. The reason for this is due to advanced infrared sensing technology. The multi-gas clips infrared LEL sensor is immune to sensor poisoning and detects gas even in inert environments. Also, the MGC does not need to be calibrated for one full year. When you purchase your MGC monitor, it will come in a box like this. You will receive one certificate of calibration. One quick start guide. One power supply. One calibration cap and one multi gas monitor. To get started, press the button to activate the monitor. This will start the sequence of the sensor motioning to auto zero. This will take approximately 30 to 45 seconds to stabilize and be ready to use. To turn off monitor, simply press and hold the button for three seconds. To view all other gas clip products and information, please go to www gasclip.tech.com. Thank you and be safe. Hi, I'm Will Galt. I'm the territory manager for Gasclip Technologies in the Gulf North region. Now what the Gulf North region is, is all of Texas except for Houston and the coastline. It's going to be New Mexico, Oklahoma, Kansas, Arkansas, and then Louisiana North. So, I'm also here to tell you about the MGC Simple. The MGC Simple is a four gas monitor with a two year runtime that never needs to be charged, never needs to be calibrated. It detects H2S, 
CO, O2, and LEL. It's immune to H2S and silicone poisoning. Gas clips infrared technology with a one button and easy to read screen. No wonder it stands above the rest. Also, the benefits to having an MGC is the software. It's free software, by the way. And through an IR link or docking station, you're going to be able to pull up any and all records. You can customize this monitor any way you would like. In the user message space, personalize it with a name. Job site. Change any and all settings that we have. If you don't like 10 and 15 as the H2S, and you want to drop that to 10 and 5, you can do it. Now, let's talk about the record keeping. Record keeping is on an Excel spreadsheet, you're going to be able to see every event, bump, or calibration. Also, there's a second by second data logging. And on the second by second data logging, you're going to be able to see every exposure exactly the date, the time, the second that it hit, whether it was high alarms or low alarms, from the very beginning all the way to the very end. Let me show you on the next screen exactly what I'm talking about. So here's what you would be able to expect to see from your logs with the MGC symbol. You've got an event log, you've got bump logs, you've got your calibration logs, whether they passed or failed, and then your second by second data logging. In the second by second data logging, as you can see, you've got your date, time, and second, whether it was a multi-alarm, whether they were high alarms, low alarms, or a combination there in between and when it cleared, the percentages of the LEL, the PPMs of the gas exposures during that time. This was really a brief overview of the MGC simple, the data logs, and the benefits to your company. So what are really the values of your company? Long life, simple to use, simple to maintain, with a reliability you can count on. The MGC Simple. Call me and let's see how gas clip technologies can be the perfect fit for you and your gas detection needs. My name is Will Galt and my number is 469-309-8467. My name is Jacob Kugler. I'm the Regional Sales Manager for the Gulf South Region for Gas Clip Technologies. My region covers from Corpus Christi to Houston, all the way to New Orleans, Louisiana. In order to understand where we are in this industry, we have to know where we've been. So I want to give you a brief history lesson on gas detection. Through, throughout the 1900s and early, early 20th century, coal miners would bring canaries down in tunnels with them as an early sign of detection system for life-threatening gases like carbon dioxide, carbon monoxide, and methane. The canary is a really loud songbird. So it would stop singing and it'd eventually die if not removed from those gases. So obviously if the birds stopped talking, the guys would run out of the rig. The first gas detectors in the industrial age were flame safety lamps or a Davy lamp. And those date back to the 1800s. And it was to detect methane. Basically what it would do is it was an oil-based lamp and had a fl uh, adjusted flame in it. And it would, in the presence of methane, the flame would grow. And in the depletion of oxygen, it would drop. And in some parts of the world, that is still used as a, as a safety measure. The modern era of gas detection started in the 1920s, the development of the catalytic bead by Dr. Jo Oliver Johnson. And he was employed at the Standard Oil Company in California, which is now Chevron. And basically a catalytic bead is, um, it's what it is. It's a bead on a wire. And what happens is it's coated in a catalyst. And when it, if it's supposed to be seeing methane, that catalyst will heat up. And it'll cause a heat discharge, and that would set it into, into alarm. So causing it to, to erode, and it could be easily poisoned. So obviously, it had to move along. We had to move along, and we did, and we started doing um, infrared. Originally, gas detectors were produced to detect a single gas, but modern units may detect several toxic or combustible gases, or even a combination of both. Both, which leads me to this. We need to the multi-gas clip Simple Plus or the MGC Simple Plus for short. This unit has four gas sensors to detect H2S, CO, O2, and IRLL sensor. The unit is lightweight, it's just under a pound, and has an LED screen to show you the detectors doing along with bright red alarm systems and sound to let you know when it's going off. It has a built-in logging system that stores 25 bump tests, 25 events, and 25 calibrations with a continuous data log that holds two months data period. 
This unit is a disposable detector with a battery life of 1,095 continuous days and has a three year warranty. So along with the proof technology and the warranty, this unit is perfect for any of your gas detection needs with a limited cost of ownership. Again, I wanna thank you for stopping by and for your time. And please, if you have any questions regarding this unit or any of our other products, feel free to contact me anytime. Thank you. I'm Kerry Sedevic, Western Regional Manager for Gas Clip Technologies. So I handle Washington, Oregon, California, Arizona, Nevada, Idaho, Alaska, and Hawaii. So if you live in one of those states, please contact me directly, or you can visit www.gasclittech.com for additional information. So the reason I'm here today is to talk to you about the MGC IR pump, okay? So I'm gonna to talk to you in terms of twos as great things come in pairs. So to start, there are two general types of gas detections. One would be fixed systems. The second being portable personal wearables, okay? We'll let others do the fixed. We choose to dominate with the most advanced designs and the latest technologies with all of our units using non-dispersive infrared sensors. Back to the two theme. So there are two general classifications of portable personal wearables, okay? One being diffusion, which is something that you actually wear on your person. The second being pump style. While there are many applications to use a pump, there are two general reasons why you would choose to use a pump. One is accessing the atmosphere above the person or below the person. So prime example, I'm a utility worker. I go out, I open up a manhole cover and I wanna test the atmosphere before I send somebody down in. So what I can do is I can have anywhere from a one to a 75 foot hose attached, okay? The unit will draw in one foot per second. So if I have a 75 foot hose, it's going to take at least 75 seconds for that atmosphere to actually enter in the unit to start being detected. Okay, so let's get on to the unit itself. Two by two, that equals four. This is a four gas detector. So there is an O2 oxygen sensor, a CO carbon monoxide sensor, H2S hydrogen sulfide sensor, and an LEL, which is your explosive gases. Okay, so the unit itself. Uh, one button uh, operation for access to all the menu system, LCD screen for a large readout for all your visual information, two sets of LED flashing lights when it does alarm and an extremely loud alarm a siren. Okay. On the back, extremely durable fixed fittings, uh, metal fittings and uh, fasteners. And then of course, back to the two theme, there are actually two screws that access two filters. Okay a hydrophobic and a particulate filter that actually stop all foreign matter from actually entering into the unit before uh, the atmosphere is detected. So easily uh, accessible and changed out in the field. So thanks very much for listening. And for more information, please contact us. Thanks. Hello, I'm Chuck Jackson with Gas Clip Technologies. I'm the Southeast Regional Sales Manager and I cover the states of North and South Carolina, Georgia, Florida, Alabama, Tennessee, in Mississippi. Today I'm going to be showing you our GCT docking station. Our docking stations are designed for bump testing and calibrating our gas detection units. They're built with simplicity and ease of use in mind and they're very rugged and also very portable. As you will see here we have four bays which means that we can bump test or calibrate four units at a time. The quad gas that we use is in the cylinder here, which is attached to the regulator and secured by the strap. All you do is attach that to the regulator and you're good to go. As I mentioned, we can bump test these simultaneously. I went ahead and inserted three of the units in here. I'm gonna insert the fourth. And all you do is you put these face down and it clicks. There's two lights here. There's a red light and a green light, a red button and a green button. To bump test, you use the red button and all you do is you hit it and the docking station will start applying gas. You heard four audible beeps. That means that the docking station knows that you have four units in here and it's applying gas to all four simultaneously. Now it's completed that and is evacuating the gas from the docking station and bringing in fresh air. So the readings will go back down to zero. There's lights above each unit up here. Once these lights turn green, that means that your units have passed the bump test. 
And once this amber light uh, goes from blinking amber to green, that means you're completely done. When this is done, there's a flash drive that's inside the unit itself. Anytime you bump test, anytime you calibrate, all the information is downloaded into this flash drive. For compliance purposes or just for your own internal knowledge, you can take this flash drive out, put it in your computer, download all the log information that's, uh, that was contained in the units itself when it was being bump tested. These units are designed to be very rugged. It's in a very hard shell case and very durable. You can take these to some of the most harshest job sites and they work really, really well. But for all of our products, you can visit our website at www.gasclip.tech.com or you can call us. You can reach us at 972-775-7577. And we will be happy to answer any questions you may have. And more importantly, we look forward to working with you. Thank you so much and have a fantastic day. Hi, my name is Maury Smith. I'm with Gas Clip Technologies as a regional sales manager based in Denver, Colorado. My region is Colorado, Utah, Wyoming, Montana, and North Dakota. I was asked today to introduce a new product, a motorized sampling pump that we will be bringing out and accepting pre-orders the end of May. And this particular sampling pump has a two foot per second draw out to a maximum of 75 feet. It does have multiple alarms to let you know if the pump has become uh, blocked, both visual and audible alarms to uh, give you a heads up. Uh, it is a rechargeable unit that is has uh, designed to run up to 52 hours on a single charge and will have a recharge similar to our MGC standard unit. Uh, this particular unit weighs eight ounces and is 6.4 by 2.6 by 1.25 designed to fit easily into the palm of your hand uh, for uh, easy and convenient pre-sampling before entering a confined space. Uh, the temperature range on this unit is a minus 22 to a 50 degree C, so it's designed for rugged industrial use. It is an IP67 dust type unit, uh, also designed to prevent water ingress up to a meter of water for 30 minutes. Uh, this particular unit is designed for pre-test of confined space. If you've been on the top of a tower or tank or standing at the edge of a confined space and had to try to get a pre-test using a string and lowering the uh, monitor down and guessing at the different levels, this is a way to get an accurate, simple reading on the atmosphere inside the confined space. Uh, it is a unit that is designed for rugged environmental use, oil and gas, um, water, wastewater, pretty much any type of, of uh, application where a pretest for confined space is required. Uh, it is designed to work with our telescoping sampler pump or probe, and it, it pretty much works on any diffusion type monitor. Uh, for any additional questions, please contact our inside sales at 1-877-525-0808.